Welcome to the draw number eight. I'm James Bott, joined by the one and only Rizzo. Rizzo, it's time for the draw once more, my friend. And the first team <laughs> is... Boise, Boise State! State. <laughs> oh, Boise State! Oh, hold on. <laughs> Dignitas! Yeah, Dignitas! <laughs> Rebellion! Ooh. What is this? We're getting a lot of the invited teams right off the bat here. Pirates on a boat! FOB! Zealous! First class! All right, so we got first class blue team. Gonna be playing. It works. Funny flip! G, what is it? G Mansions! Next up, so that's Mizu's team. Luminosity! Oh, it's Savant. Oh, I'm so sorry, uh, okay. Savant. Hey, bro! Okay. Souk Partik! Oh, he didn't. So that means that we have young whippersnappers going up against Torment's minions. There's a clear out from Cheese. Backward boom. This is a hard bounce. Magic Bear can't read it. And Oath will drop this in. Watch out for Oath. We've seen him in a lot of the draws, uh, actually. And he even, like, regained some of the other tournaments we've hosted as well. We've seen Adam quite a bit. Oh, oh what a save. What are the no way? Are you Jeez. serious? That's so fortunate. That was, I can't believe Cheese uh, didn't put that in, though. And also the fact that the ball just launched right at a defender. Magic Bear bails Luminosity out. It was a very light tap over to Oath, which gave him a nice angle. Oath was ready for it. We might see another one. We do! He's different. Magic Bear round one. Will he get the 50 on night? He does. He wins it, too. Rettles. It's a bump. Is it enough? It will be. The 50 goes straight to Cheese. So I'm going upfield. There's still... Oh, this ball is still up. Adam Whoa. with a great beat. He doesn't have a second touch. Rettles goes to the backboard. Oh! But he didn't go down far enough. Knight puts it away with nothing on the clock. This is Rocket League! Sorry. <laughs> I had to do it. <laughs> Infield pass. That's a great pass. Cheese, though, couldn't beat the keeper. And Cheese must have been out of boost. Putting on the best shot that he could low, but that one was such a good opportunity. He has oh, another one, and there's a go. Wait, what? Oh, How, what what no even way. happened there? The save was clutch. First off, last second save right here, but it also lands right back on Cheese's head. He's Through the there. explosion. How does he know? Ball goes back tonight. It's actually a miss. No way. Wow. Rattles just, I, I can't believe this miss. Honestly, Rattles just I walks mean, he, up. And a big back and forth night with an opportunity. The shot top right. That is great placement, but cheese. Even better heads up play for the save. And Magic Bear just going to roll it in. Just going to roll it in. And I'm very sorry. I have so much respect for your son. And uh He's gonna need a little bit of a comeback in this one. Adam with a great start. <laughs> Look at Adam's shot. He's completely upside down. Somehow gets all that power. Denied. Rettles trying to get there. Back pass. No way. That he does back it again. pass actually. Oh. What do you, Rizzo? I'm gonna let you say what, what you want to say about this. I mean, it is just it is a pass back from Rettles, but Goth is there. Goth is ready and waiting. Now we'll see if the LG can get it back. This is a great 50. Cheese is there. No oh, way. Are you serious? Adam gets the save. I can't believe that. Cheese looking for a bump. He almost got it on Oath. Rettles was ready and waiting for a potential tap. And this is a great pass. Oh, the bump play. Cheese. Oh, luminosity. Two goals to make up. This could be a chance. Pass over to Magic Bear. Magic Bear back to Rettles. Rettles off the backboard. Magic Bear, bounce shot, saved by Night Cheese, has one boost and can't shoot it. Oh! I, thought, I thought he owned gold, but it's just off the post. He couldn't get possession of that ball. It was just a little too fast. And Savants take the series win over not L. Quite to be. I have to bide your time here for Sukpartik. This roster, Zanil, Lion Blaze, can say they've always looked strong everywhere they've gone. Can end up relaying out. Hey, bro, and their offense has been stunted. They haven't gotten a lot of area in front of the goal until now. All it takes is one passing play. Hockey out to wave. One way or another, even if they're the ones to put the ball there, are somehow able to find clearance. It's still, though. Oh, and if this one goes Whoa. in. Oh, look. What? 
to the side. Wow, we may see some normalization of the ball game. How about a musty flick 50 to take this out? Long clear out to Kinsey off the crossbar. So close. And Lion Blaze may just have the dagger. He does. Poised for the counter, but I agree. I, I don't think that is on. Hey, bros, decision making creams. This could be the goal of the day. You've got to be joking me. Perfect redirect. Cream saw Lion Blaze ring the crossbar and said, what? I will do you 10 times better. That's insanity on the angle. Tux it outward. Hockey with a chance. Whole lot of boost here as well. Reset available. Demolition on his teammate, but he's still going to muscle it through. You just can't stop hockey. You marked all random answers on the Scantron, but you still got the right answer. There's another challenge and a demo, which results in another big clear. Jeez. Wavy's winning at the middle of the field, however, and one gap is all it takes. Hey, bro, on top. Is this even Rocket League anymore? Like, like honestly, maybe this is the peak of Rocket League. I don't know. I feel like Wavy has just been corralled to the center of the map. We're seeing the pinnacle of defensive performance for Haybro, and they're getting... Oh, no, please, please. Ooh. Wavy, big <laughs> He's good. Way to bail me out right there. Yep. And now going back the other way with plenty of boost. And a flip oh. reset to boot oh. right to Creams. That is how you score a transition offense goal. It's actually insane. I, I feel inclined to think that Sukpartik were thinking the same way I was, where it's like, why can't we get anything past these guys? Well... You finally have. Line plays post on the side again. It's a dart towards the net. It forces Creams to get that savior medal of the game. Kinsey back on the ball again. Flipper reset available. Shot there. It's a deal. Puts it through. Game five imminent. Needs a little bit of assistance on this sequence, but still gets a challenge out. Line plays sends on and a big save, albeit a double. And the ingenuity is starting to show itself here. All it takes is Ooh. one big touch. Creams pulls from the crossbar. And hey, bro, try to get their push started. Creams pulls off, though. Kinsey with a passing lane one-on-one -on -one goes over the top but cream's massive save to make job's not done just yet but that's about oh, as no. good as you can start the sequence with but the gap is open lion blaze <laughs> sends Haybro out of the tournament in the first round of play getting very physical and he does find toasty this one waterfall in front of the net justin able to read it the 50 toasty goes mm. low oh and justin can't get there pirate strike first social just lock in the boost in the defensive rotation right there and shopify rebellion Take that mistake. Two piece. Nice musty flick. Gonna find the secondary goal. You cannot help this team out just yet. <laughs> you can never count them out. Beautiful flip reset there from two piece. A little bit of a musty as well. Justin can go ahead and clear that one towards the opposite end. And look who's waiting for that one. Parth. You have to find a way to be creative and, and open up some opportunities that weren't there beforehand. And demoing is one of them. Speaking of which, look at Parth equalizing the scoreboard. And they're gonna make this one a one to one ball game. And Parth just kind of cooking everybody, breaking ankles. And he kind of gives that little hesitation challenge right there, but does dive in and make a save, but they're not out of the woods yet as Parth makes a nice touch here. Justin does dive in. Justin, another touch to two-piece. Oh my goodness, what a play. Yeah, the one-two punch. I mean, on top of that, look at Parth just pop off and, you know, Justin with the overtake. It took all three members to push past Shopify, and they got super creative on that one as well. Fire Rebellion, take the sweep. This will fall right back onto their half, trying to find an equalizer. Jaytens down to Ponda, but Nolly. Taking the time, seeing Realize react, decided to hold his water as the flip uses it. And the man who scored first scores twice here tonight. 105 remaining, and Torment's minions on a rampage. He's seen himself have some of the biggest highlights in all of Rocket League history, and he's going to try to put one in here for the draw number eight. Is realized, puts one down. No, what a save. And that sm small amount of hesitation sees the first goal on for young whippersnappers, and it could be two. Jay Tins. This is Rocket League, to say the least. Nolly by himself on an island as Jay Tins unable to get that shot on. And, you know, Nolly just he didn't seem like he had enough boost. Seemed that he may have been in a bad rotation of prowess, but able to use just enough to come out of that one unscathed as a great job here by young whippersnappers of stopping a goal line save with potentially give it a first and realize gets credited for that goal. Hurt this squad before it's realized shot on Nolly gets it away. And that one as close as you can ask for, but nobody back. 
Yes, it is! J10s! J10s! Good job by Punda. We'll be able to keep this towards mid, but come! The Devo can't go! And JNAPS finishes it off! The team in Torment's minions find their way into round number two. And I'm just loving how quickly Boise State is just falling behind one another. The defense always so close to get a second man back. Ooh. But now, the challenge here, one, two connection. Evo's got it in off an amazing pass. The setup from Eris originally, and Arsenal will have it top that one down. That is... We saw Boise controlling a lot of the pace on the field and the possession of the ball, but things have switched considerably here. Whoa! In the, in the offensive end of the field and their rotation is getting stranded as another shot is on target here Eris somehow off the self pass on the wall it's a 50 actually that spits right back out to them and they just get a little piece of it to the opposite corner um, but also very aware of how to follow each other's plays up get some of these really large oh. long field <laughs> passing plays as Evo will absolutely style on him out of the corner Arsenal spots him downfield and that control was immaculate. I should say they definitely picked up this pace as the net looks to be open. Eris just gets the touch. Arsenal almost own goals, but it's still out. How did they keep that one alive? Oh, so smart Whoa. there from Durtho. Couldn't read Whoa. it off the post. And finally, Preston. And I mean, finally. That could have been absolutely heartbreaking. And they could have absolutely let that one go by the wayside. Okay, they were able to clean it up, but you don't want to have to have that player because not everyone to find boost as Evo will clean up here for Dignitas. And Boise now might get it, but Eris follows up quickly. Preston gets a good touch there, but gets bumped around. Trying to bump the last man, Ooh. and Evo will still slot it in despite the player coming out and getting a touch on it. Let's see what Boise have in store to try to respond quickly here. Oh boy. And, oh, oh what a goodness, save there. What a block out. Shot on target, saved by Woozy off the crossbar. Almost came through, but there was no follow up. Pressing here to the sidewall. The re, perhaps. No, Woozy can't finish. And Durth wants to get back. It's off the backboard. Is there a follow up? Arsenal off the crossbar, and we have overtime. Evo floats one. Shootable. Not a great. Oh. Okay. That's game. Um, I was going to say, not a great shot. What happened? All oh. three players go for it, and Evo's touch is just too low. Dinks it over his teammate and past the other one. Eris, a tap to the side. Oh, they're looking for the passing plays yet again. Oh, ho, ho. Arsenal absolutely slapped that. Boise State just keeping alive here as it is still dangerous. Eris with a bit of space has stopped it out to the side, though. They didn't have the control or positioning. Quite put it on target. Pat uh, Preston can't get a touch <laughs> as the Devils come through. Dignitas just removed every player from the field they could. That's so smart from Eris. So, so smart. The first team around two. Drawn is... FOB! Souk Partik! Funny flip! It's Rebellion! Oh, so funny flip draws Rebellion. Alpha Cap has selected on the draw. <laughs> Round two. Blue team, match number three is... Torment's oh, Minions! Okay, buddy. It's Dignitas! Oh my, oh my gosh! gosh. <laughs> oh. Savants, who we just saw beat Luminosity, and they will be playing... G Mansions. Okay, so that is the last matchup. Savants versus G Mansions. That was a good, that was a fun one. Now, to be one situation for Torment's minions. Calm gets to round one. Might be looking for a pass or like ground pinch it off the oh. back. Or that's that's an amazing pass. Well, this is that 2K plus Elo chess player brain. He's always trying to think a move ahead. Goes for the pinch pass. Actually tried to get a bump or a demo. But regardless, so unexpected from Com. It's Evo a great 50. With a massive dunk oh, the the Arsenal, and JNF saved it. How did JNF save that? Torment's minions on the offensive. JNF goes for a goal. Oh. He just shoots it. What a snipe! Com pops over one, goes for the bump on Arsenal. Oh, no way! It's the Com 200 IQ bump to help out his team, Ooh. but look at that shot! Board down and out, that was so close! Shouldn't have a big 
problem with it. Nully now trying to catch up to his touch. Oh, will be able to. Jams is there. What? They meet in the air. It's not even a pinch. It's just a Was little hug. Was it a hug. pull shot? Did Janabs actually get bumped by Nolly into this? No, he bumped him right as he shot it. <laughs> but did that make the shot any better? I don't know. <laughs> One thing that is for certain is that Torment's minions are entertaining to watch. <laughs> oh, oh my, my god! No, he's rolling in! Is he rolling in? God is a beast! He got a double, right? Or is this a triple? Yes, he demos Ares and he demos Evo! Oh my, and the ball just rolling up. It was almost on target. Nolly had to come in and finish the job, but if Cobb's gonna make it that easy, it's not much of a job to begin with. A bit of confusion on offense, but Arsenal gets it going. Has the flip, it's on target, and Eris is there for the follow-up. Fake from Nolly. Eris trying to wrap it around, goes for a bomb, no and way. it's gonna be a goal. Eris ditches the ball. The bump threat Helped out in the end. Oh, this pinch is really odd. And JNAPS oh! is there. Two players from Dignitas just sitting in net because this 50 was just out of nowhere. Oh, JNAPS gets the full corner and instantly goes into goal scorer mode. Get this ball anywhere they want it to be. Oh, and I love that bailout from Nolly, and it's going to go lead to a goal. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Cobb can't hit the shot, but that was genius from Nolly. Only 30 seconds to go. Nolly with a great catch. There's two players up there for Dignitas, and this should be a huge clear downfield. Nolly might be able to score it. Oh! And Janus, how I, just a little bit more. <laughs> to the right. It's off the post. Nolly gets it over to Janus, and he slots it away, and that should do it. That's going to secure it. That's another hat trick. Another, another hat trick for Janus. He's doing it all. Oh, my goodness. They were able to fend off elimination in game three, but in game four, they met the big dog. It's JNAPS! Five minutes here in game number one of the best of five series. Wallace from the downs of the heavens can't get it, but Drew puts it in. Has had a lot of success in the upper levels as well. It hasn't just been in CRL as they prove once again with Zanil able to make this shot a beautiful, I believe, was this a breezy or was it a, uh, I believe that's a breezy. So able to just easy breezy, lemon squeezy underneath the post. Great shot and able to immediately eliminate the two goal deficit. A good territory as well as the good Ooh. shot makes a great effort. And you know, they were acquired Currently still looking for that roster, but still sporting the FOB. Ooh. Basically, as Lion Blaze had to be patient nope. for this team in blue. That's the type of stat line you're hoping to have on your side. The good 50 will leave it to the corner. Cam getting demo there as the Neil now just trying to find a teammate upfield. We'll be able to hit oh. him. It will go oh. as that will tie us up at one. A unbelievable redirect. A great heads up play by Zanil and an even smarter play from Kinsei. Once again, has the flip reset in hand, trying to work their way in. The pass over to Drew, the quick shot, finds the bump and able to get the goal with 16 seconds remaining. Midfield, his final couple seconds falling upon us. Lion Blaze, no can't way. take down, no! <laughs> and this is a moment where boys become men and these players <laughs> play at the top of Rocket League. <laughs> and Zanil says, Wolfie, my facial hair is coming and I've been a man for a while. As the teamwork between Lion Blazes and Neil wrap things up. But I think Parth and Justin are the biggest heavy hitters for Shopify and a two piece coming up, but Justin scoring already here for Shopify. Side was completely removed from the play and it was perfect for Shopify to just steal a goal. So you don't necessarily in. just agree oh. with the, the, the funny flip tech there as we see a six goal now from Shopify. 350 still to play here. It took a little bit longer to find that opening goal here in game two, but I always say that game two very rarely looks the oh. same as game number one as this shot comes in. Well defended that time. Fifi trying to take us up into the orange half of the field now. Looking for Cosmic and it's 2-0! The most dangerous lead in esports. Congratulations, Bunny Flip. Uh, don't jinx it. Plenty of time left. 3.30 on the clock. We're seeing good play out of both teams, but Funny Flip looking to extend it. Two players on. Two piece makes the save off his own bar, and Parth's going to be downfield in a 2v1. That's a big challenge. In defense, but here comes Parth. Set it up for Justin. No! Oh, There's two piece, excuse me, but T-Bar with a great <laughs> save. Am I smelling an overtime potential here already in this game number three? Because that's what it feels like as T-Bar says, no, 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 I'm just cooking. That's just me cooking right now. That's what you're smelling. 
Oh, that pass from Cosmic. T-Bar was looking for a play on that ball himself, but Justin, oh, 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 oh. the interference means he's going to just head up field, and that redirect is disgusting. The pace on that, the touch. Oh, that's light as a feather. 40 seconds left here. This is an opportunity. Parth looking to dribble. We saw how lethal he was earlier. Passing it to two piece, looking for a bump, but Cosmic coming in clutch on the line and Fifi to clear. I think they've done a great job of neutralizing Justin for most of this series, and, and some of it's been a bit of inaccuracies from Justin as well. Justin getting credited for a save there, but ultimately Funny Flip coming away with a goal here. It's going to be two pieces missed touchdown to T Bar and a beautiful bump from Fifi. Uh, you know, sometimes you got to use your butt, you know, to, to make a save. It, <laughs> it works. It trusts me. Like, it works for, for offensive linemen too. It's a great save from Justin. And now here, they're waiting in their own zone for a counterattack. Two piece shooting it on net, but a huge save from Fifi. He's going to send this one to OT. Trying to do the one man thing. Just Justin Tings, just Justin Tings. We got a game five. Shot by Ramon. I think they kind of woke up. I don't know if they took like, you know, they, they just had some gamer fuel or something. But uh, two piece oh. add to the score line, five one now. Two piece, a double tap machine. This time pass from Parth. And that angle is disgusting. No one's gonna read that placement just perfectly under the bar. As we now have a very tiny movement. In fact, no movement at all. We're gonna pause the game here. Uh, looks like uh, we're having some connections issues with one of our players. So when we come back, we will finally conclude this game. Savants! <gasps> These two are not playing each other. Um, oh, not playing Savants. Or not playing Savants. Rebellion, <laughs> yes. Not playing Savants. So it's Rebellion! Torments Minions! Torments so Minions versus Savants. And so that means that we have Sook Partik going up against Rebellion. Um, it is obviously still extremely early, so we'll see if they can get out of that, but Super Partique off to a great start. Oh my, what a demo! Two-piece clutches a save, and Justin can't get the follow-up save. Lion Blaze again, a second goal already. Justin off the corner now. Par takes a quick shot. Zanil will get the save, and he'll get a second touch oh, what here. what a double! Now it's just Justin back. Has to make a save. The fake is good. It just slides right underneath Justin. He's gonna try to force it downfield, lands a demo. Justin again trying to force Lion Blaze off the ball. Lion Blaze launches this downfield. Is that on target? It is! See Two Piece again. He has a chance to touch this. Can he take the shot? He'll cause an own goal. A great play from Two Piece. Finally, it seems like they're able to find to break through. And this was an offensive pop-off. Great pass to himself off the ceiling. Oh, Kids A chasing a bump. This, oh, this is, is a is huge wide open. overcommit, open Two net. Piece. You can't miss, he miss this! He missed! He but didn't. Parth will finish! No, he missed! He didn't miss! He missed! He didn't miss! He was passing! He was no, passing! He, he's passing? Yes! Oh my goodness, good thing Parth was there! Nobody from Shopify able to follow it. Justin will go for this again. This is a great catch. What Stop a the touch! Has no a flip way. as well. He'll get oh. the second and Justin! My hero! Justin is him! Look at that! He pinches the touch out into a flip reset. That was unreal, Justin! And he flips into the boost as well. Kinsey is working this corner. Gets a pass out to the middle. Where's the shot? There it is, but it's far and out. That should have been the tying goal. And now it finally comes through. The pressure proved to be too much. Great attack from Supartite. So now they're back finally on defense. We'll see if they can get this back upfield, but they've had a lot of opportunities already in this OT, and this is another one. Parth able to take oh, it high, gets a bump, and oh. Kinsey can't get to it. Parth does it all himself. Immediate decision from Two Piece to go for that high percentage play. And now another goal oh. for Justin. Rebellion, back-to-back -back goals in the first minute. Supartite with the great 50. Justin in an awkward spot. It goes past him. This one's just open. And they found a gap again. That lead has been dwindled to just one. And now almost wiped out entirely. But Two Piece gets the save. Justin now over to the corner. Might have a chance to shoot this as well. And oh, oh big Kinsey save. Swipes it away. There's only one defender left. Daniel pops over one. Justin light lob towards net. Lion Blaze goes straight up the middle. Parth will go to the backboard. A little awkward for Zanil. He's stuck oh, he's on the stuck. crossbar. Oh, no. But ultimately, Shopify Rebellion close the game out. We'll complete the reverse sweep and will secure their spot in the grand finals where they will be playing Torments Minions. Now JNAP's going for a Zen shot. Two-piece. We'll stay on the backboard. 
Fake from Nolly, and that's, that's a goal! A... That was so smart! Stick the landing there. He's gonna give up the ball. And Nolly, who's chasing a bump, JNAPS plays it off the bounce. He has a oh, shot, and baby. Forth is able to just pinch it away, but the offense isn't Another done yet. Fake. Another fake! Oh, what a save from Two Piece! They're starting to see it coming now, but it still almost worked. And there's a bounce shot, and it's off the post and out. Part tips it up. All the players from Torment's Minions lunge at that ball. Stop the offense, but Justin is up. Nolly, can he get a piece of it? He won't be able to. Justin ends it in OT. Nolly, up and over. There's a pinch. It actually was pinched by two piece back. And now a dunk from JNAPS. Rebound to Calm to JNAPS. JNAPS trying to take some time. Justin. Oh, oh my! The ground pinch from Justin! He completely catches everyone by surprise. Pixel perfect placement. Justin off the ceiling. That stopped out at the midfield. Justin looking for a pass over. Justin will just stay on it and Justin will score. Justin is a machine right now. He's on fire. This ball off the side while he realizes Calm is just sitting back. And has time to nail the placement. Top left corner. But now he's still low boost. We've seen that a few times where the boost starvation was just too much. Four torments minions in the pass. And there's Justin once more. Justin with another huge speed play. Back down to the ground. Goes for the pass. What? Oh. How did that work? But still, Calm is able to get the stop. On top of it, Nolly with a pop-up off the ceiling. Oh, Calm actually got tangled up on the crossbar, and it cost him again. The crossbar is taking heads today. It has to be here. Justin had pre-jumped, and it is here. Back-to-back -back demos. Calm on the respawn. Calm keeps it alive. Now, oh, JNAPS goes for goal, and that's oh. an easy save. Rebellion win the draw number eight. Oh, my goodness. And your champions, Shopify Rebellion, they have won the draw yet again, Rizzo. And it seems like no matter where we go, no matter what we do, Shopify Rebellion hunt us down and win our events. <laughs>